What's, what's up, up guys? guys? What's Welcome happening? back. We're back again. We're back again, and this time we're darker. Oh, I mean, I mean the beers are darker. Why are you looking at me when you said that, man? Damn, mm -hmm. peripherals, right? <laughs> 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 Uh, but anyways, welcome back to another episode of La Pura Neta. Uh, we are your hosts. My name is Mario. I am Ozzy. Drizzy Dre. And today we are, as I said, we are going to be trying out some darker beers today. We did mention we were going to bring in much more warmer beers and we are going to go on the heavy shit. So today we are trying out. And it's out fall season. It's fall. It is, it's it's perfect sure is. weather for these perfect type of beers. Ujata. Officially. Yes. When's the first day of fall? It's already mm. started, dude. It's been started, but there's like an official date on the calendar, right? I it mean, now they have official dates for this stuff. I guess. I think it's like, I think it's like September 28th. Does it matter like now? That. Because it's fucking, it's November and it's fucking 75 degrees. Yeah, that's true. Right. Anyways, <laughs> fuck. So I don't think it matters anymore. It doesn't, but um, climate, climate, global warming. Climate, climate change is really I mean, best. calendar wise, we are in fall right now. Uh, but today, our first, uh, and and to go with the warm weather, our first porter today has a little bit of coconut in it. Oh, oh okay. that's right. I see what you did there. I know. All right, so we today what we, we have a uh, we have a we have a podcast favorite brewery, uh, Phase Three. Phase Three. The name of it is called New, because it's a new beer to us. Oh, I see what you did there. <laughs> uh, it's a toasted coconut porter. Uh, it is, I believe, we got a gold one. Oh, we finally got. Ooh. Yep, we're, we're changing. We're, we're changing colors. Uh, this I'm is only a uh, surprisingly enough for a porter. It's only a six point two. Pretty light. That's well, porter porters are a little bit lighter than uh, stouts. Wait till you see the other fucking porter I got. <laughs> That's what she said. Don't scare me, man. Right. All right. But anyways, uh, so this uh, Donata Corn Lake Zurich. Shout out to Lake Zurich. Six zero zero four seven. You guys gotta get closer to the city, man. It's kind of far. All right. But anyways, <laughs> uh, yeah. So because of the fact that uh, that this is a porter, like most thoughts, a um, little bit of coffee always ends up at the bottom. So of course you want to flip these bad boys over, roll them a bit. This one's gonna be a little unique because I believe little bits of coconut might, like little coconut what? shreds, might actually be in the beer. So don't be shocked if uh, so they, they were like at the end when they were brewing the beer that they they were just like let's zest it up real quick. Uh, and it's yeah. dairy free. Yeah, dairy That's, free. Ain't that sound? Uh, what? We use real coconut. Coconut is high in oils. Sometimes these oils. Yeah. So vegan. Sometimes these oils float at the top of the beers. We use coconut in. It it's might God. look a bit odd, but it's harmless. Enjoy. I like the uh, nice little warning they yeah, got this there. little warning. Be like, hey, if this shit looks weird, don't trip. Right. Don't be a little bitch. If, them, if something, you know, if there's a little residue in it, shut the fuck up and drink it. If, if it's better if it has fucking residue. Let's go. It's authentic. Entitled beer drinkers, what's wrong with you? Drink it. Ding. Damn, we all served it perfectly. Oh, wait. Yeah. We're about wait, to find wait, out wait, right wait, now. Wait. Here we go. Oh, he got it. 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 Here we go, 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 and blue, perfect. It's like Coca-Cola. <laughs> For real. Right, let's do it. Got ourselves a polar bear here. Root beer floats. Uh, oh, so. What cup you got there? Five rabbits? No, uh, five rabbits. Five rabbits, cerveceria. Cerveceria. Oh, chilo, chilo, we are a bilingual show. Get it right, get that it right. That is true. That They're is true. No, get this anyway, get this anyway. This three floyds. Three floyds. Well, man. Three floyds. Okay. And right here, uh, Black Shirt Brewing. Black Shirt Brewing, a, uh, a Colorado. From Denver, company. Colorado. From, Denver. From their time in the Colorado, Indiana, in the in the, in the Rockies, Illinois, Severias. Okay, cool. All right, guys, let's uh, sniff this. Cer you know, you already know. Ceremonial yeah. sniffs. Oh, traditional Ooh. porters. I smell nice. Ooh, I smell, I smell like caffeine. Oh my god. I smell coconut. It smells so good. Yeah, you do smell the coconut, right? Yeah. I do. Oh, okay, okay. It smells like. All right. Let's that go. smells like it's going to be an enjoyable drink. Okay, cool, guys. All right, here we go, guys. I see y'all phase three always coming in with the good stuff, man. Salud. Bink. Bink. God damn. <laughs> that coconut kicks in. That has a lot of coconut. Holy shit. Kind of tastes like a... Uh, what are those? Uh, chocolates? 
Uh, uh, fucking uh, Almond Joys. Almond, almond Joys. Yeah, joys. dude, this is a fucking Almond Joy beer. It's like an Almond Joy. This ain't bad. No, it's I like it. Good. It's nice and sweet. Yeah, it it's takes sweet. away the it takes away the overwhelming um, coffee taste. Pour, yeah, coffee yeah, taste dude, that it really kind of kills it sometimes. It's yeah. a little chocolatey. Yeah, Does yeah. It have chocolate. This is dope. The man, the cans dope. They look like the eighties. That eighties uh, teal. It looks, and like, it looks like fucking purple. Miami Vice, dude. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> um, this is three oh five. Hey, I'm liking this a lot, dude. This, this is legitimate. Good. This 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 tastes like a chocolate uh, uh candy bar, like this an almond joy. Yep. Very good. Um, wow. it's not thick. It's not. It's not it, too it's, thick. It's not. It's it, pretty it, dark, but it's not. Thick. It's the right amount of runny. Uh, the bitterness is countered by the uh by 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 the, the coconut, and this shit is fucking perfectly balanced. It's good. Yeah, Damn, they this blend, ain't bad. They, they blend in really well. This is really good, guys. Yep. I'm I'm happy with this. Yeah. What do you guys want to rate this? But I'm gonna give this bitch an eight. And I give it an eight. That's exactly what I was thinking. Eight. I'm gonna yeah. give it a seven. You're gonna give it a seven? That's fine, dude. Man, I'm gonna give it a seven. Great. This is, this I know you don't like dark beers. This will you, make dude. me feel no, cool. Like this will make me feel cool at a bar if I drink this or at a party. They can be like, "What you drinking, bro?" And I'm be like, "Man, you're not good for this, bro. You can't. Do, you can't. Yeah, you, you know. If you don't know what this is, you are, not, you are not men. You are not men. Yeah." This is men. This yeah, is dude, that coconut is just fucking just standing delicious. out, dude. I'm, I'm, I'm straight up drinking a fucking. I'm, I'm, I'm drinking I, a. But I'm, it's not a, like overwhelming coconut. No, it's, not. it's not like because I don't yeah. like coconut coconut that much, and this is pretty good. Um, this like honestly, this is like the best way I could describe it is if it, this is a fucking pina colada with a little dash of fucking coffee, <laughs> coffee in it, dude. Kind of, yeah. Yeah, I follow. And, choc- it, it, and it's not frozen. It's the only like, mean. It's like teeth. chocolate. I could taste a little bit of chocolate in it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I can smell I, I mean, the chocolate. I, would, I, would, sure. I mean, I would, I would expect it more. Doesn't, doesn't, doesn't porters have a little bit more chocolate than no. the stouts do? Or, do, or no, the stouts have, have, have the chocolate? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I don't know. This man. is some mother freaking spiked Ovaltine, bro. This <laughs> is cold, <laughs> man. This is my iced coffee brewed, cold, cold brew looking ass. You know what I'm saying? There's actually, there's actually beers that are cold brew beers. I will oh yeah, yeah. See. We uh, I had one at uh, what is it called? Uh, what's the? Uh, oh yeah, yeah. We had one in Founders. W- what's the? Well, yeah. What's the nitro one? <laughs> yeah, KBS. No, no, not KBS. Um, whatever. Yeah, it was a weird yeah, name. Whatever their nitro cold, uh, cold brew beer is, dude. That one was that actually was really, really fucking good. <laughs> This oh, this man. is great for like when you're having those really early morning days. You want waking up. You woke up. Oh at, yeah, you woke dude. up at five a.m. Your day's been starting by nine o'clock, bro. You can take one of these, man, and just put it in the McDonald's cup. They're gonna be like, we, <laughs> he's drinking. He's drinking that all black iced coffee. His soul is dark. I'm be like, bro, man, I, my Let's day go. is already a fourth in. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, this is delicious, Mario. Thank you. Oh no problem, man. Wait this till we try. I want to try out the next one because the next one is a uh, is a new brewery that we haven't had in the. Uh, on the uh, on the podcast yet, but uh, so let me ask this question now that Ozzy's tried the beer because he's like, I'm not gonna chug this. Tell us, tell us about your your bet, guys. We got Sunday Sunday football. Oh yeah, I'm not gonna what? what? So, I'm not gonna it hasn't, chug. Ha- it hasn't happened yet. It I'm has, not gonna it, it, chug this. It, 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 it hasn't happened yet, but if. By the time we release this episode, the Saints would have already won by now. So nah. Saints and Steelers this Sunday. Uh, loser has to chuck a. Take that, Mitch what kind of a fucking beer do we have to fucking chug? Any yeah, beer. Uh, I'll, I'll get some beer. We'll see. We'll get some beer. Any fucking, beer. Who's no, gonna be out here? No, I'm not gonna chuck something like this. No, I'm not twelve percent in here, bro. Get that twelve percent in <laughs> I ain't here, bro. Trying to get super fucked up. Get get yourself some fucking uh, get 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 some bur- uh, what is it called? Some single barrel fucking dragon smoke in this bitch, dude. <laughs> I was dreaming about s'mores the other day, guys. I was no, like, me too, oh, I hope to one day go me to too. Benny's and just come up one day. That'd and be- then you'd be like, oh, it's real. Oh, my God. Dude, that was so fucking good. I can't stop thinking about that beer. Super good. Super good. But we'll, let's let's leave that in the past or until we go back to Michigan. But, yeah. uh, but no, yeah. So we have a we have a bet going on right now. A that friendly the, wager, if you will. Yeah. Loser has to, has to chug a... I'm going to uh, win. It's Steelers and Saints, dude. It's gonna be a fucking tie game, dude. No, we're both, we're both, we're both right gonna now. fucking lose, dude. <laughs> they both fucking. Hey, suck. but talking about fucking teams that were sucking ass last year, we were whooping ass. Go fucking birds, dude. Fucking Eagles, fucking bro. Eagles, Eagles whooping that ass. Are they still undefeated? Yeah, I think they're like they're undefeated. Yeah, they're eight and zero right now. Eight and zero. Yeah, dude. They don't win. They don't win. Shit. Or at least make it to the playoffs. They fucking. Hey, can I can I throw in a special? They're already in the fucking playoffs, dude. There's like how many more fucking games are there? Left like five fucking regular games now. True story, yeah. Yeah, it's like what? It's like thirteen weeks of regular football. Hey, I'm gonna throw. I want to throw in a special rule to you guys. Is bet um, if you get if your uh, game goes into overtime, you guys should drink a beer automatically. Oh yeah, dude. Yeah. Fuck. You know what? Because so you you're making us chug two beers. <laughs> if it goes into no, overtime, if it goes way. into overtime, but also I see, I see that shit happening because both these fucking teams suck ass trying to get fucking touchdowns. I'll get, I'll get some light beers then. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, 
we'll record it. We'll record it. Get some fucking we'll get, uh, get some PBRs. Let's yeah. go, dude. Get some I'll fucking two PBR. percenters, dude. Let's go. Okay. Okay. PBR. That's fair. That's fair. Uh, but um, I do want to bring up uh, a subject that we did talk about. I'm not sure if it was last week or the week before. Um, biggest hoes in cinematic uh, <laughs> history. Oh, that was some triple B's or conversation, guys. That's only. Uh, that's the only. Yeah. We were too. Oh, so man. who won? Uh, no, 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 no. We, we had we, three contestants. We had three contestants, but we needed to add a fourth, and I and I've decided on my fourth. Who are the contestants? Not, well, can you repeat the three first ones? So the so the original three is we have Jenny from uh, Forrest Gump. Forrest. She's we a home. Yeah, ho. She's a home. We have a uh, we certified. have she had fat <coughs> hair problems. Certified. We have a uh, what is it called? Uh, Rose from Titanic who. Lip, lip but she back. did it for money, so which is uh, gold, I mean, uh, she's no, a gold digger. Hold up, hold up, hold up. She, she happily married woman had children, dies, and instead of going to heaven with her husband, decides to go with her fucking one night stand boyfriend on the ship. Uh, <laughs> she a lion hoe. Yeah, uh, <laughs> certified. Whatever, what whoever lion ju- hope. whoever Julia Roberts' character is in Closer, uh, she a hoe. <laughs> she's scandalous. Scandalous ass hoe. And this next one, Julia. Gonna, no. It's a, it's a guy. Oh, oh what? We, Here we go. Who? Batman. Uh, whoa. whoa. <laughs> you're close, actually. No, you're not, actually. Aww. <laughs> uh, Vince Vaughn. In the movie when he has a whole bunch of kids? No. Starbucks? No. Uh, Vince Vaughn in fucking Wedding Crashers. Oh, what? Vince Vaughn and Wedding Crashers. Huh? Yes. Is Be- he a hoe? I would say Vince Vaughn in the movie Swingers, but yeah. not, not uh, Wedding Crashers. If we're gonna if we're gonna go into Swingers, then uh, then instead of Vince Vaughn, it would have to be uh, uh, what's his fucking name? Uh, Director of Star Wars. John Favreau. John, yeah, John Favreau. Favreau. He's the, what? He's going through a heartbreak in that movie. And they go, oh, dude. <laughs> what? I'm so confused. Okay. What? <laughs> I'm so confused. Yo. She's the, he's a, okay. Like elaborate on your com- your argument. All right, go All for right, it. Here we go. Uh, First, been fun. Also, because we need a guy on the on the list, we can't just you know just make it straight. Uh, yeah, I guess he is a whole. universal word. Yeah, I all guess, day every day, bro. I guess he is a whole and you know when he what? crashes because the, he, he's like a, at the first beginning of the movie he's showing that he's had he, sex with a whole bunch of girls. Not not only that, but he is so fucking he is so dedicated to the fucking game when when homeboy doesn't want to fucking play the game anymore true he goes what the fuck is wrong with you true just like 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 you th- like you think i'm doing this shit because i want like no dude this is a fucking like this it's a tradition right <laughs> so this man is in it for the love of the game dude i get you that's some whole mentality that's some, that's some whole shit whole cert- that's cert- that's certified with a capital c because okay. because it was between him or i was going to add another girl to it who? And uh, and it's not a movie, but it's a fucking TV series. Uh, uh, what is it called? Uh, I believe the name of the fucking. Sh- I, th- I think I believe the name of the show is is called uh, uh, fucking it, True Love or some shit like that. It's right. on Netflix. So, anyways. Uh, well, I mean, if we're we're going to TV shows, then Barney Simpson from How I Met Your Mother. <laughs> that motherfucker's a hoe. He was in it for the game too. Yeah, <laughs> true. Oh no, and it wouldn't even be him. It would be Robin. Robin. Sure. Robin would be the biggest hoe. My counter argument to Vince Vaughn's defense: Will Ferrell is the biggest hoe in that movie. Yeah, he is. Oh, that is. He's yeah, the one who passed on the fucking. He's the one who passed on the, the, funeral, the, the knowledge, bro. And then he's transitioned into a whole different <laughs> field, bro. <laughs> Holy shit! That's like you know, like <laughs> fucking movie. Will dude. Ferrell, oh damn, that? dude! Now that I think, you know what? All right, my. I, I my you forgot my, about Will Ferrell. My, he only came my, out like in my, one scene. My, my my votes out then. Are, oh, you know what? Hold on, hold on. What about? Oh, here we go. Fuck it. I'm gonna go with Rachel from fuck. Uh, uh, what is it called? The uh, no, not from Friends, but in uh, from Batman. Who she has to choose between Bruce Wayne or uh, or what is it called? Harvey or Harvey, Harvey Dent. Dent. Oh, that's and Homegirl oh. decides to go with fucking Harvey Dent. Oh. The wrong choice. That's problematic. Is she a hoe? No, she's not a hoe. She's not a hoe, dude. I she's feel bad for her, though. She was in a rock and a hard place. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Batman was a rock. I'm trying to think of who else could be a hoe. Yeah, Is it really just down to those three? 
I don't know, I man. So, I still, I'm still question mark uh, the Julia Roberts one because I haven't seen Closer. Oh, you need to watch the movie. It should still be like it should be like on Hulu or like Amazon. I don't think it's on Netflix anymore. But uh, Barney from uh, How I Met Your Mother, man, he's up there, bro. That's um, yeah, he's, he's a big up there. Because even he's even a hoe in uh, um, Harold and Kumar go to White Castle. Yeah, he's a hoe there too. And he's himself. Yeah, but not gay. No. And PH wouldn't do that. He wouldn't. <laughs> <laughs> <And> PH. <gasps> <gasps> no, thank God you fucking brought this up. Ooh. Now I know who the uh, now I know who to add to this fucking list. Controversy. Here we go. Uh God, what the fuck was her name? Uh but anyways, you remember Starship Troopers? Just because of the fact that you brought up Neil Patrick Harris. You Starship remember that show Starship Troopers? Uh, they they, they uh, oh, the girl in they, show. they they go into they they go into space to fucking kill fight, bugs. Yeah, fight bugs. It was a movie, right? Like uh-huh. a long time ago. Yeah, like, whatever okay. the fucking guy's fucking name is is like is like Casper Van Buren, Mier- or whatever the fuck his name is. I remember uh, there was boobies in that movie. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so do you rem- do you remember the main character? Do you remember his girlfriend? When you see her boobies, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you don't see her boobies. The you, boobies see, you see, you, you see, oh, the, you see the one he's messing with, right? You see, you see the one oh, he ends up messing with. Okay, the one that he's not loyal to. I can, I can recall. Okay, okay, I can see faces. So, 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 so the girl whose boobs you do see, she not a hoe. She, 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 she let on. She, she main girl, dude. She, 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 she she's like she's wife status, dude. She came because in she was ass. dedicated to his ass and only his ass. And they were in the military. It's fucked up. Uh, God damn it! What the fuck is her name, dude? Uh, actress married to Charlie Sheen, Denise Richards. There we go. Denise, Denise, Denise Richards, Richards character. Uh, Denise Richards character in uh. Wait, they in, were married. Charlie Sheen were, and her. Yeah, they were married for like. What? Uh, he yeah. does know celebrity gossip, bro. He said that. I'm almost certain that they were married. They were like not for long, but they were married. Bro, for a he couple was, years. he was certain. <laughs> He just started. Not only that, but it broke. It's, it, it's like Charlie Sheen back in the day. Back in the day, dude. Back, when he was, but he was a hunk. Damn. A so hunk. like, like, we're like, like we're talking like, uh, what is it? Like platoon. Platoon. Charlie. Uh, Charlie Sheen. He was dude. buff then. And that movie he was buff. buff. Cute. <laughs> God damn, dude. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. So, uh, but anyways, re- reason why her? Uh, so she, Denise Richards. She's you, a hoe. You're a hoe, dude. She, <laughs> uh, she, 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 ho. she plays around with my, with my boy Rico's feelings, and then she dumps him because <laughs> she, she goes, "I'm gonna be a career woman." Perfectly fine. And again, and she this, ends this up. Is up tru- this is Starship tru- tru- Troopers. And then she, yeah, and then she ends up hooking up with homeboy that was his, was was was, was, was Rico's I feel like fucking this is more of a drama. Now the way that you're saying is more like a drama. <laughs> Oh, movie. man, they were she's the, still a hoe, dude. Bu- they and they bugs. were in the military. <laughs> you guys are some hoes. <laughs> hey, hey, you're killing hey, bugs, hey, and you some hoe bugs. Hey, every, <laughs> uh, dude, everyone was there for the fucking, for, for, for the boobies and the bug killing. I was there for the drama. <laughs> Wait a minute. So, repeat the lineup, man. This is a whole other contest, man. All Booty right, so money. we have Denise Richards in, uh, in Starship Troopers. Chacho. We have Julia Roberts in Closer. We have... Uh, uh, what is it called? Kate Winslet as Rose in in uh in Titanic, and then we have whoever the fuck that actress is that fucking played Jenny in uh Jenna in uh in I have Forrest a question. Gump. I have a question. When we refer to Rose and Titanic as a hoe, are we talking about the old lady that's narrating the story? Yeah, or are we talking old about lady. Kate Winslet? Yeah, she's old a hoe. lady, dude. Because she's because, the whole one, right? She's, yeah, because when she she's was young, one. because because when she was because when she was young. <laughs> On the ship, she was just a fucking teenage girl in love, dude. Yeah, she wasn't even. What, I mean, she wasn't even sixteen or something. Like she was that. seventeen years old, I think. Oh, okay. So I think her, she was like seventeen. Still, years Kate, old. who? What's her name? Kate. Uh, Kate, Kate. Kate Winslet. Kate, Kate, Kate Winslet. Winslet. Okay, you may be off the hook, girl. Wait a second. Stay tuned. Nah. That, that's true. But old, but old version of. Uh, uh, oh, uh, but oh. she's 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 been oh, she's oh, been oh, bored. Girl. She's been oh, bored. Dude. She's been bored into hoedism. Okay, yes. I see what you did. Nah. She was already developed hoe by then. Ooh. So, are we talking about being a hoe? Just. For being the fact of being a hoe, no. So for, for a reason of being a hoe, uh, or getting close to your death date and choosing your fate. Here we go. She was so, like, I've been had time to figure it out. All right, here we go. Money before, don't give me that. I, they need my judgment. Give, so <laughs> money doesn't they do, warm me up like they, that. Scene. So, so the way I would put it is that they do something in the movie that is inexcusably. Ho shit. That they don't really have to do it, but they they do it. It it ends up happening. Okay. Yes. All right. For example, Jenny. 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 Fucking sleeps around. Yeah. Gets uh 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 
He gets a uh, gets, gets Molly whopped in front of Forrest, and then he fucking, gotta go steal off the guy from the Black Panthers and stuff. Man, you put him in a whole different situation. Yeah, my boy, my poor Forrest was just trying to get through it. Man, he was in the military he was trying to fight for his. I'm just trying to run, save yeah, mama. She kept Forrest Bro, in the fucking Jenny's back pocket, dude. <laughs> she did. She a uh, homegirl got STDs, has a kid with with, with Forrest, doesn't tell him, and then she fucking ups and dies and leaves his ass with the kid. <laughs> just like that. Home. <laughs> sorry. Oh <laughs> shit. Sorry, Jenny. Rose, I'm gonna host since the '80s, dude. You had Ho- a, you Hose was raised to be a hoe. Rose for Rose the money. Had, Rose had expectations. No, 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 no. And no, she no. deterred from the plan. No, no, no. She was, she, she was, she was, she was, she was, she was raised to be a hoe. But in her teenage years, she fought against that because she fell in love with a poor boy. Mm. However, once she got to America, <laughs> hoe mentality. Here we go. I mean, the guy she loved died. Dude, she fell in love. Dude, she falls. She falls in love. Has kids, has a happy fucking life, and then all of a sudden they bring up one fucking painting about some fucking guy who painted her on a ship, and all of a sudden she goes, now she's I want entitled. My, like I want that dick." And back. then she throw away the uh, she really throws away the fu- fucking yeah. ju- the jewel of the ocean. Yeah, yeah, yeah the fucking whatever the, the the jewel of the sea, whatever the fuck it's jewel called. Jewel of the sea, whatever. But my boy Leo's out there frozen in the motherfucking river, and y'all bitches out here talking stories and shit, bro. Yeah, He's still frozen out there. Yeah. Somebody go get him. And He's like it, this. And then in the afterlife, <laughs> and then in the afterlife, <laughs> instead of uh, instead of going with homeboy that fucking said, uh, 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 you know, till death do us part, she goes with homeboy that, uh, that said, don't ever let go, Rose. Don't exactly. ever let go. Don't ever go to this boner. She let go. She don't ever let go, go of this boner. <coughs> wow. All right, judgment time. All right, guys. All right, I'm eliminating Julia Roberts from the uh, from discussion here. Uh, man, who was the fourth one? Uh, Denise Richardson. Uh, yeah, she was up. She was up there. You had me with the cinematic, uh, dramatic stuff. But, yeah, dude. Uh, uh, I'm sticking with she, my first one. My gut goes Jen A. Jen A. Jen A. You I'm been, gonna go to Jenny too. You traumatized you go me Jenny? when I was Fuck, a kid, dude, So I automatically fucking lost the goddamn. Uh, uh, I, I already now lost you gotta chug a beer. Woo! No, no, <laughs> that wasn't it. All we know is that Jenny's a hoe. Jen A. Jen A. Jenny. Well, what, what do you choose then? I was gonna you? say Rose, dude. Rose. Ooh. I mean, see, I had to break it up into two parts, man. It's yeah. like you know, young Rose. She was, you know, she was blind in love. You know, she was steamy love. You know, those dude, you chose you chose your hookup instead of your husband. But I think her husband was already dead, no? So was Jack. Sometimes <laughs> the fuck true. But sometimes you take that love to the grave, man. And then she was around a bunch of strangers. She was like, "Yeah, man." When she I was literally high, took it to when, the grave. It sounds like an old, any old lady at a bar. She's like, "When no, I was dude. when I was young, they used to drive me naked." No, dude. <laughs> no, no, dude. That that this is the uh, the, back this, in, the, the, back the, in my, the dude. this to her. This is the fucking. Uh, Jack is the is the Brazilian helicopter fucking pilot that uh that she met during her fucking uh honeymoon phase. <laughs> I was like motherfucker. No, I nobody ever touched me like that you. again, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Were you trying to make a Brazilian accent? I don't know. That's not Portuguese for sure. That was uh, more like uh But know. anyways, this beer's fire, dude. This beer is uh, great. Beer's great. We found out Jenny's a hoe. That's that new new. Yeah. Uh, Jenny's a new new. We're praying. We're, we're praying that we actually get a good football game on Sunday. Yes. Uh, yeah, at least make it fun. At least, at least try, guys. Try, you right. guys. Come on, absolutely. God fucking damn Please it, try. Dude. And don't forget to follow Phase Three Brewery on all social media platforms. Oh, absolutely, do and follow not, us on all five social media rabbits. platforms. Yeah, dude. And three Floyd, and three Floyd, and, and black, black shirt. shirt brew. Dude, but yeah. their pizza is fucking delicious. <laughs> yeah, it is. If, if you guys are watching all this fire content, we're giving you all this information. Their Nobody's pizza following was them. better than all the pizzas we had in in Grand Rapids. Support, yeah, dude. support it these was. fine businesses, man. What's the matter with y'all? Because okay. I still remember how it fucking tasted, and dude. Oh, I still remember when it. I, I still remember when it was fucking served to us. <laughs> the girl served it to us, and we were fucking lit. It was by the time it, we got there. On a yet, scale of dude, one to one eighty two, what are you? What were you? One eighty two. It's over. <laughs> Uh, but no, yes. Uh, what is it called? Since we're talking about uh, following stuff, follow us on uh, on, on Instagram, on uh, on YouTube, and not only that, folks, follow us on Facebook, dude. Like I get it, dude. Like maybe, I guess follow us on TikTok too. And or TikTok whatever. as well, dude. Or whatever. Uh, what is your TikTok handle? You got a uh, you got a good one. <laughs> I like his. He picked a good one. Oh, yeah, he's like was, six days in, bro. He's six days in, and he's already got a. And he's already got. Follow a me on TikTok. My name is. <laughs> Cause I was really thinking about it, but I was like, ah, fuck it. All day IPAs a la verga. <laughs> <laughs> and the funny thing was, is that it was available. It was no spaces, no spaces. <laughs> I'm the original one, bitch. God damn, dude. 
That's a good one. That's a that's a hell of a TikTok. <laughs> They're called Fucky Charms. And I haven't even watched a video yet, a full video. And he's like, he's a liar, anymore. bro. I've sent him a million videos. If you watch this shit, it also, hey. not opens up to his account. His ass looking at it like, do not, dude. <laughs> the fucking. I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna use it. I just don't you have to, dude. Mm-hmm. I, I I already know the perfect fucking TikToks for you. There's a fucking there's a TikTok channel that talks about that translate uh that translates the summary that summarizes fucking novelas in English. For I'm real? Glad they're fucking wild. I watch that. <laughs> like, like, like th- they talk about like Ruby. They talk about like fucking, <laughs> uh, fucking Rosa de whatever the fuck is called. Rosa de Guadalupe. Amigas y rivales. They, they, yeah, I forgot what else they fucking. They talk about la supadora. They summarize it in English, like like in English in the best fucking way. Like, 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 do you want drama and incest at the same time? Let me introduce <laughs> you to la, la, la usurpadora. Just so you guys know, my little sister was named after the little girl in that novela. Ooh, it's baby. <laughs> and he said, that's hilarious. That's hilarious. <laughs> but uh, there is a t- Hold on. Before that, before we go to break, there's a TikTok video that literally like translates what Hispanic people sings are. So it's like ponte las pilas. He's like pump the brakes, pump the brakes. And then there's like no, uh, no, no, that's not me. Ponte, ponte, no, po- Wait, no, no. The, I ponte, said it wrong. Say it again. Translate pon- it. Uh, ponte, ponte las pilas. pilas. Just put the batteries on. Put the batteries on. Basically, get you, like, like, basically, get it on. Come on. Yeah, just like, ponte go. Yeah. There you go. Let's There's go. like, pump, put the batteries on. And then there was another one that was oh, like, yeah. huevo. And she was like, eggs. 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 A huevo. Eggs. A huevo y huevos. Go to break. <laughs> All right, we're going to go to break. And we'll be back because this beer fucking hit us. Let's go. And there's another one coming. Let's Ooh. go. Welcome back. Back. Shout He's out back. to Boats and Hoes. Shout out to Boats and Hoes. Boats and Hoes, yes. Boats that's, and Hoes. That's what we were prepping with. Gotta get me and my Boats and Hoes. The Nina, the Santa, Santa Maria. Ooh. Oh, snap. Shout out to Columbus. <laughs> <laughs> we got a whole setup change Nina, over here, man. The, the, pizza, the Santa Maria. The uh, setup change is different. So, yeah. So, now we're trying out a... Uh, uh, what this is? We're trying out a brand new... Uh, no. Have we had No, this? we had them before. We've had them before. All right, never mind. I was wrong before. Uh, but you know what? But it is. You were right about being black. Home. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, so we have ourselves uh, from what is it called? Moore's Beer. No. A, where is it? Moore's Brewing Company. And it's not like M O R E. It's M O O R. It's not like Mega. Okay, it's not like Mega. It's not like Megazord Moore's. <coughs> All right. Here's the thing. He was right. This is the first of this beer. I said no because it's canned by 18th Street Brewing. But it's brewed oh. by Moore's. Beer. Okay. Okay. Anyways, so new brewery, same yeah. cannery. All right. Here we go. <laughs> Ooh, remix. Not only that, but this is our this is our first and only so far black owned uh, brewery. Hell yeah! Let's From, go. And in case you guys haven't noticed, in spirit of uh of well, when this gets released, um, it would it would have already come out, but. Wakanda forever. <laughs> <laughs> R.I.P. to Chadwick Boseman, man. Chadwick yeah. Boseman. Number 42, forever. Number 42, forever. We do not do that here. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. There's a different brewery, but it's, um, they brew and can it at 18th Street Brewery. Ah, but anyway, so this is their, uh, what is it, Imperial uh, Porter? Imperial Porter. Imperial Man, Porter. It's a stout. Let's call it a stout. I guess, I'm not sure. But uh, I know. all I know is that so far, all of their beers have a, basically like a 1970s black man dressed up as a English king in almost every beer. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, this is kind of old. Dude. I was, I was, go- I thought it was an ode to like dude, Eddie, Murphy, Eddie Murphy coming to America. It's more than a year old. Even better, dude. Which is better for a porter or Hell, a here we go, baby. It, it was aged for a year. Woo. Let's go. This doesn't look like Eddie Murphy coming to America. Like this, this I thought this was like homage. It does. This was homage. <laughs> Why it, not, dude? That's not to be funny. This is homage. No, that's fun. That's so clever. So you, it's called Moore's. Moors, Moors, as in like a Moor, <laughs> like 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 the like the people who who fucked up the Italians and the Spanish oh. in like the fifteen hundreds, oh. and basically that's the reason they have dark skin. A history lesson for y'all motherfuckers. Did you what else? Y'all didn't know that, did you? Hey man, let's shout out our, our beer cups because they deserve some uh, yeah, praise too. They were frozen. But yeah, they're about like, yeah. So they're a little bit cold. So now they're so now this beer is really gonna be fucking me staying cold for a minute, dude. Let's see here. I got a uh, shout out to Dogfish Head. Half I got, acre. I got Lakefront Brewery, baby. <laughs> One Wisconsin, more, then we go. Illinois. 
Fuck, where are they from? Dogfish. I'm gonna go with like Seattle. No. No. Like Arizona or somewhere over there. Arizona. I forgot. Knows how to party. Let's go. Oh, and if anyone's asking, this is an 8.4%. Or like South Carolina or somewhere down there. Uh, headquarters. Oh, Milton. this is in Delaware. This is in, in Delaware. Delaware. Milton. Delaware, the number De- first state, number one state. De- Delaware, the first state. Look, guys, I'm in Delaware. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing's happening. Yet. Um, but anyways, hey, yes. Kids, if you guys didn't know, Delaware is the first state. It's the first state. It's the first. It's the and first. And it's the state it's that the first everybody quarter. forgets about. Yeah. Because, but it's the first quarter everyone got. Ungrateful bastards. Yes. Uh, but this. Yeah, so Ooh. this fucking beer is a, uh, this is an 8.3 percent. Yeah, so, take it slow, because this motherfucker is, I think, this is more like a stout than a fucking porter. No, oh, wait, that was about to sniff it. Bring it up with the boss, man, I don't pretty, know what you want me to do. Pretty dark. Bring it up with the boss, man. Here we go. They got porters, they got stout. Dude, this shit straight up look like a goddamn fucking... Chocomila la verga. Chocomila la verga. Pacho Pantera la verga. I like the way the frog looks. Shout out to the man coming coming to America. That's a good movie. (laughs) (laughs) I like it. Fun. But it's on every one of their beers, though. So, Anyways. so so other other labels are like this. Yeah, all their labels have like a fucking black king on it. What is the? Uh, we got a uh, ten, forever. ten, twenty, twenty, twenty one. Yeah. Yes. Oh, it's a year old. It's Ooh. literally a year old. A yeah. year old. You didn't change. <clears throat> this is Tariq Ibn Ziyad, Led Moors. Cool. All right. Anyway. Oh, so they're they're kings from from Moors. Oh, they're Moorish kings. Oh, there we go. Right at that. Didn't even know that shit. Uh, but cool. also, I will say, this is also probably... Man, this fucking beer was expensive, dude. How much was it? A fucking four-pack of this shit was 17 bucks. Chacho, coño, madre. This is... <laughs> brewed and canned by 18th Street Dude, Brewery. the fucking... Uh, the, the Phase 3 one was a fucking four-pack for 13 bucks. Yeah, because it's cheaper. Yeah, that's alcohol. That's true, dude. Yeah, yeah that's alcohol. True. Yeah, that's true. M- right. Moresbeer.com, guys. I don't know to see social media, but we're going to find them. We're going to follow them. I spell spell I, I M- them on Instagram. O- we're going to find them. M-O-O-R-S. We're going to find you, and we're going to follow you. All right, anyways. we're going to talk to you. All right, let's go. Let's we're get gonna this started. Drink, we're going to drink your beer. And... Whoa. Mm, okay, what smells, is that? It smells like licorice. Okay. Hmm. Mm, okay, mm. I was I, I I I was so used to the coconut smell that the other one that that that, that mm-hmm. this one kind of threw me off. Yep. This one smells medicine-y. All right then. Well, Did you guys hint that. Like, yeah. So here we go. Well, it is supposed to be better. Yes, I go. Salud, mi familia. I know it's not like me decent. This shit's chocolatey. Yeah, there we go. I'm gonna try it. That's thicker. Yeah, for sure. That's what she said. <laughs> oh, snap. Oh, snap. Dude, this beer blends in with my shit shirt. Got a fucking, like, this beer blends in with This shit got a kick to it. This one had residue, for sure. Yeah. I just drank that all. <laughs> yeah. So it is thicker than the last one. Definitely roll this bad boy. You could taste the alcohol in it. Hell yeah, dude. Thicker than a Snickers, baby. You know what I'm saying? This is definitely... Um, you could taste the chocolate. I, I think that they put dark chocolate because it's kind of dark chocolate yeah. tasting. Because it's a little bit bitter. Yeah. Um, <coughs> Esta negra. Ooh. It's not. It so tastes like coffee. It's a straight up. This is this straight up tastes porter. like coffee. Yeah. This is. This might be the most porter that there that that porter can get. It's a very mm. traditional. Well. <laughs> anyways, uh, <laughs> but I do. All right. So, things that I like. Uh, for as bitter as it is, it doesn't make me. No, it's not, like, I mean it's not that that type of bitter. It's not like, a, like no. an IPA. Yeah. No, 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 no. But but I mean like even just with the coffee alone the, like like if you have like coffee by itself and you're not fucking ready for it it fucking hits you true um i do like the higher volume of alcohol 
that 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 like you can feel you can feel the warmness kicking in. <laughs> you can feel the warmness kicking in. <coughs> Even though I know alcohol doesn't make you warm. You, Shut up. You can feel the the pain that I'm about to start. Yeah. Um, uh, it was a good idea to pour these bad bitches. What the hell are you doing? It, 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 it's a yeah, it's it's a good idea to pour this with. I'm a, gonna clean my palate. Yes. It's a it's a good idea to to, to definitely drink this with a cold glass. Yes. Yeah, because sure. you want it. Because this this it needs to be it, colder than, than when we're drinking in it. Yeah. I feel but, like right. Yeah, it needs to be a little bit more colder. However, this. Okay, and again, because of the fact that you need to have it in a cold glass, because you cannot chug this beer. This I beer, mean, you can, you can, but it will but fuck, it'll fuck you, you up. up, dude. That's when you get to the point of the night where you're just like, "Damn, I went too far." <laughs> this is this, <laughs> this is a this is a nightcap beer. Yeah, like you drink like you drink this beer, you're gonna knock the fuck out. You respect this beer, hell That's yeah. That's what dude. you do, shit. I'm drinking it slow. I'm still trying you to tell like, it. Thank you for t- trying to give me all the taste notes, bro. This shit. <laughs> This is definitely a a porter like no other. Yeah. All right. What are we grading this one? I'm gonna give this one a seven. I'm gonna give it a six. Six. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna give it a six too because only because yeah the porters. It I've needs tried, a little more flavor, dude. The porter I've tried. The porters mm-hmm. I've tried in the past, like the coffee taste is there, but like they got the extra taste of, of flavor whatever on they top of it. Yeah. You know? I like. This is like really respectful to the, the taste of a porter without yeah, any so add-ons. I like the straight coffee flavor with just the fucking. It, it, it's almost like if I'm just drinking coffee with a shot of Bailey's in it. And to tell you the truth, the Bailey's also give you the Irish taste, cream taste. It doesn't taste like an Imperial. I don't to know me. what an Imperial means. I know, right? I don't feel regal at all. That word is that word is gang related in my vocabulary, so I do not know what you are <laughs> what trying imperials? to refer to. Um, you gotta taste more imperial oh, beer so you can this, know what I'm talking oh, about. So, it, <laughs> so what? So this fucking can gives you a little history lesson on the on the picture of who's on it. So this is let me see, in eight in seven eleven uh, AD, Tariq uh, Ibn Sayyad let moors of uh, Berber across oh, uh, descend across the Strait of Gibraltar uh, between Africa and Europe, conquering Spain for the next seven hundred fucking years. Not only that, Damn. not only that, not only that. The motherfuckers took also also took over um, Italy. That's why that's why Sicilians have dark skin. Dark skin. Uh, but I'll, but no, not only that because of, because of the Moors. That's the reason the Crusades happened as well. For because real? the Moors were Muslim. For real, Moors were Muslim. So 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 when so, so so when everyone so when everyone shits on like Christians. Not only for, do you get info about beer, you get info about history and religion. Uh, really? But no, yeah. So when ev- when everyone shits on, uh, especially Spaniards. especially when Obama did it, when he shits like, yeah, Christians were, uh, you know, we were, uh, they've always been uh, oppressing people all over the world. Um, remember um, the Crusades? This is a fucking wonderful impression of Obama. I just want to say, that. Obama. Uh, this is- but you know, he shits on <laughs> he, he shits on he shits on Christians for 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 the Crusades. He's like, you guys did horrible things. I'm like, y'all remember the Moors? They, they were worse. Muslim, baby. Guess what they did. They appropriated Europe. <laughs> <laughs> <And> appropriated. <coughs> That's fucked up. Not only that. Hey, but you know what? Para que aprendan de su pinche historia, güeyes. But you know what, dude? They gave us tan skin, too, so I can't fucking complain. Thank you. Let's go. Nubian goddess over Let's here. Go. Let's go. Mira. A Prieto. Nubian prince right here. This man knows the way. <laughs> Mira. Ah, ya estoy bueno. Uh, ah, man. Marca. That's a hell of a farmer's tan. This, dude, how you know, know. this is how you know he's mixed race. Tell you know I'm Mexican for real, bro. I really like this. I like this beer because it really. I'm like saying it enhances all the bold flavors of what comes with a porter. I think I've just been uh, really spoiled with good porters. The, the hazy, not I mean, good porters. This is not necessarily a bad porter. This is a good porter. I'm just saying like other porters. Nah, bro, you fucked up. For for <laughs> I did fuck up, right? <laughs> do 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 Let I just think it, Do I think it's worth the price tag? <laughs> Maybe if it was a couple bucks cheaper. Yeah. A four seventeen bucks for a four pack might be pushing it. I would pay fourteen for a four pack. It's not a dragon's milk, bro. It's not a dragon's milk, that's true. But Sorry. Such high standards. But up in however, here, I can see if entitled. Entitled. I can I, I can see this oh. becoming someone's go to fucking porter. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like it'd be like, Hey man, I'm gonna fucking drink a beer. They're fuck they pour one of these bad boys out and you know what? They're good. 
you're gonna get fucked up like you're gonna get you're gonna get where you want to be and you know what it's not bad tasting is anybody tempted to like uh put a, a dollop of uh some vanilla ice cream up in this mug and just, oh like, you make yourself a fucking float dude man, it's a morse like, float. like we told you and it's a little bit more flavor it would, like right. not a not a not a big all right scoop so, of ice cream so just like a little so you would you would add a little bit more sweetness to it then that sweetness flavor flavor all right it's a little bit bland so here it we go to me so what i what i would see this as is that this is a very good beer to make a cocktail with yeah if you guys have I'm ever not, had what kind of cocktails do you make uh, with yeah. porters oh let's you, listen you, you can make you can make you can make uh <laughs> Uh, beer cocktails. My mom. Oh, shit. Yeah, dude. It's like it's like a screwdriver. Uh, no, no, a screwdriver isn't. It, it, it has well, a beer in it. I had a, I had a beer that was mixed with oranges and they called it screwdriver. No, that's just that's just called fucking they watered down juice, dude. That's it, those screwdrivers, vodka and orange juice. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> what they about when you put a me. blue moon fucking in blue moon Milwaukee? In what is it, like blue moon and orange juice? Like, what do you call that? A blue moon. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck that's called. Cause I don't. Cause whenever I drink blue moons, I drink them by them fucking selves, dude. True. Well, we, we put orange in that them. brunch put behavior. Orange. Put you put orange. Orange. I mean, you put it, but that's your garnish, though. No, we put orange juice. Oh, you put orange juice in yeah. it? I've never fucking done that do before. It. Do, do it. it. All right. Do All right, guys. The next time you see me, don't be surprised if you just see a fucking hospital band on my <laughs> wrist, dude. Just like, hey, dude, he tried some raw Overdid shit, dude. It. But, Overdid uh, it. But what else can you do with porters, man? I want to know about co- some more cocktails. You can like, make co- yeah, you can make cocktails with it. You can make uh, some Jager bombs, bro. You can, uh, yeah. I mean, you could. You, I mean, you, you can, can drop. M- you, yeah, you can drop shots of whiskey into it, and then just they, all, all these can become bombs. Mar- Marvel loaf cocktail, bro. Like, man. Well, it's again. It, it's not a Guinness, but it's the Guinness style. Yes. Mm. So, whatever you could do with Guinness, you could do with this. Yeah, you could do with that. Yeah. Okay. Shot of Bailey's, just mm-hmm. drop it in there. Yeah. I guess the sweeter. I guess the sweeter note is what I'm looking forward to because I mean, I, I like heavy coffee and that, but that's just like in sips, you know, it's, or like small little. It's, like I said, it's too much coffee. coffee. It's not too much coffee. It would be heavier on the coffee side for most people. I can yeah. just okay. kind of see okay. that. Yeah. yeah. You know, like I'll this is I'll enjoy it. I'll drink if it. If you're not a big caffeine drinker, porters just, and stouts are definitely not going to be your department. Just so you guys know, it means you will help. This is as long as we talked about one beer. Yeah, <laughs> just, shout out to Moors. Moors, <laughs> getting us fucking talking about it. But yeah, six, six, seven, baby. Seven. Oh, seven. I'm gonna give it a seven. I said six. Yeah. <sighs> Yeah. But what is up with people putting fucking Christmas decoration? <laughs> oh, you're already at the beginning of November. No, in the beginning of November, yeah, why not? Like, the what the peop- fuck? The dude, people that skip dude, in the beginning of November. Yeah, cosas en especiales, pero no se pasen de lanza, no mames. I don't know, nobody does Black Friday anymore. Black Friday, Black Friday starts like second week of November. <laughs> like, the prices are down, dude. For real. Do you want to know why everyone puts all their Christmas shit up November first? Because they're lazy. No, because they want to stop thinking about Thanksgiving because it is a. Uh, it, it, it's like it, it's what is it called? It's a white man's um what is it called holiday, holiday. Oh, oh my god like, oh my god look it's a man's world get it over yourself oh no but not only we're that we're gonna die anyway yeah but not only that november 1st is when um uh, homegirl th- uh thaws out uh what the fuck is her name homegirl uh fucking girl who sings the fucking christmas song uh oh, mariah carey mariah, mariah carey, carey. Oh, that's what she thaws out true dude. But it's crazy. Like Austin Powers, let me dude. ask you guys a question. <laughs> let me ask y'all a personal question. Okay, because like Thanksgiving becomes Boy, like cuckoo. remember like Thanksgiving football, Charlie Brown Thanksgiving special, <laughs> watching your favorite shows on TV, or for sports people that watch basketball all day or football all day. What what age do you turn when you just become bitter about a, like Thanksgiving as a holiday because people think about it as an adult like I got to be with my family I got to go here I got to go there I got to buy shit I got to prepare shit mm, like at what wow. age do you guys start feeling that because I, I, I can't I, even put a thumb on it I like, don't I, I don't think it's an age thing I think it just it's just yeah. it, it's it's entirely based on trauma if you've had bad experiences at Thanksgiving you fucking hate Thanksgiving That's this true. is this is the reason why a lot of people don't like christmas is because they're like i'm by myself on christmas that's why i don't like christmas and the christmas and like christmas is a very family and family. like and like romantic <laughs> yeah and then everyone's just like the, 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 i love christmas this is why it's called cuffing season because uh-huh. you you find someone to be with the from, also from, lonely. From, from, from who's also lonely from 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 halloween all the way until valentine's day and then that's when and then the day after valentine's day cuffing season is done you break free like you a break butterfly up. you break up 
That's fucked up, bro. Yeah. I hope, I hope, like well, the age people out, the age range of people that I watch our show can like sympathize. Maybe because of my mom. My mom loves Christmas. You love Christmas, yeah. and he's a Sagittarius. It's true, but but I mean, yeah, because I, I don't get, I don't get, I don't get a regular birthday like all you motherfuckers. <laughs> Think yeah, I'm out, like, Sorry, man. It's, it's your birthday. It's great. I'm gonna it's save your present. My for birthday Christmas. is a week before fucking Christmas. I'm gonna fuck? save your present for Christmas. Like his, everybody did that. Everybody's like, here's a lollipop. <laughs> no, dude, nobody. Nobody said it was my birthday. Ni un pinche lollipop. Nah, that way. No, nah, but me, last year I got him some good stuff. Because it's Christmas. <laughs> he got how I met your mother and stuff. Yeah. He got the plaque in his personal bathroom. <laughs> uh, I just be pooping. You know how I be. I just be pooping. You know how I be. Oh yeah. God damn, I thought dude. about Ozzy really, really long and hard <laughs> that birthday. I was like, the good brother. No pun intended. Uh, no. God, I fucking but, love Christmas, but, but dude. Thanksgiving to me is like, eh. So is New Year's. Eh. So I don't really give a fuck about New Year's. New Year's is just another day now. It's just another day. It's just like unless you make a ritual out of it. Yeah, you'd be yeah. like, oh, it's New Year, new me. Or you, yeah, or you're with somebody, and you're like, oh, we're celebrating like, oh, New Year's. Just like celebrating New Year's together. It's really, it, it's, it's another. But, but it, for me, Christmas and Thanksgiving are like. Those are some big deals for sure. They're bigger deals. Yeah, sure. I think I celebrate Chinese New Year more than regular fucking no, my New mate. Year. Chinese <laughs> New Year. <this> is <laughs> what is that in May? <coughs> I think it's like in March. In March, yeah. It was like in March or April or something like that. Dude. Do you order Chinese food? What? what All the fucking what are time, you? dude. What, what animal are you? I am snake. Because I was born in '89. I'm a goat. I'm a snake too. Yeah, dude. Of course. I'm a goat. 91, baby. I'm a snake. I'm G O A T. Goat. I'm a snake. Okay. Uh, this is why I got a snake on me. This beer is well, it's a dragon. Bro. It's a dragon. It's, it's a, a big ass snake. It's a Chinese dragon, even though there's a fucking dragon on the fucking Chinese zodiac thing. It's a dragon. It's a dragon. It's a dragon. It's a snake to me. Yes. But uh, yeah, 89 is Yid of the snake, and then. The year after that, I think, is horse. <laughs> horse. Horse. Peter, the horse is here. <laughs> the horse is here. <laughs> Peter. That's such a great Long Island accent. I'm going to transition to that. I'll talk to you with uh, Eight Crazy Nights. I got a lobster bib in the bathroom. I don't know what to do with it. <laughs> God damn fucking Long Island, dude. <laughs> Long Island. You guys got to watch. Uh, what's that movie with Adam Sandler and Chris Rock when the kids get married? Do, uh, uh, the week of the week of oh, oh yeah. I love that, mo- it. that movie's good. That's that good. Is. They're just talking like this all the time. Like, what are you talking about? Like, that be as good. Let's it's go cold. to Coney Island. Let's drink it. Let's have fun. God damn it, dude! <laughs> Fucking New Yorkers, dude. Bob's yeah. Burgers, you know. <laughs> wait, Bob Burgers? Oh, nah, I'm just like, <laughs> no. Wait, where is Bob's Burgers at? Though it's in New Jersey. It's in New Jersey, right? Yeah. <laughs> Told you. Oh. That's why they talk like that. Oh yeah. <coughs> I'm from like New Jersey. God damn it, dude. Jewish Long Island, New Jersey. New yeah, Jersey. dude. I love all you oh, guys. Oh, Italianish. Dude. Yeah. Dude. Please oh, no, follow no, us. No, Please New, follow us. New Jersey is a little bit more Italian than. I'll send you voice messages oh, dude, all spe- the time. Spe- speaking of New Jersey, that's also where where Big Time Tommy's at. Yeah. Oh, I fucking love big time time. He's like, like keeping it old school. <laughs> you know, old school. Listen to freestyle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, that, he's hilarious. God I think damn. I saw him on uh, Action Bronson's show. Oh, dude, man, that that fucking guy, dude. Shout out to Action Bronson. Fuck, that's delicious. Yeah, dude, for real. Uh, but anyways, yeah. I like this beer. I like this beer. The, the, I like it too. The, 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 this is a great beer to fuck around with. Shout out to Mario. He brought some double bangers today, bro. Yeah, for real, dude. Mario, we have that feeling shit. dark. I'm feeling darky. You're feeling dark. Got darky. some new. He's has feeling not, good. Uh, Got some new ink, bro. It has, has nothing to do with the depression I'm going through. Shout out. Shout your uh, tattoo artist out, bro. Oh, yeah. If you guys are looking for a tattoo artist, uh, I highly recommend this girl named Betty Payne. That it, That is what she goes by on, on Instagram. Hi, Betty. Hey, Betty. I'm not sure if she watches this or not. I'll tell her to watch it. Watch it, Betty. And follow uh, her Instagram, too. She <laughs> is a... Don't fa- ask her for your tray or your forearm, because then she'll fucking shoot you. She will... <laughs> God damn it, dude. Sorry. Don't uh, do it. Don't but do it. it. But what's it called? Uh, she is a very, very talented artist. Um, what is it called? And she is uh, she's very, very good at doing uh, uh, black and white. Black and white shading and stuff like that. she's really good at her line work. Oh, her line, her work, line is work is fucking, fucking ridiculous, good, dude. dude. Don't break my heart. Not only that, but break. I got the liberty of naming her new her new uh 
her new uh what is it called little machine thing her new gun yeah her new guns so she bought so she ended up buying two guns and we tattooing did them. you do thunder and lightning no uh we decided <laughs> no 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 we no we decided to uh we decided to, to Puñetazo. no we decided to name them uh, uh Lil- lilith and eve reason why oh, the lilith, Adam, lilith. adam's two wives uh, because one of them is meant for line work and the other one is a shader. So one, so 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 the so the shader. One of them is a shader. <laughs> one walks a straight line, the other one's shady. I see what you did there. Yeah, but no, 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 no not only that, but Eve is Eve's the one that'll treat you like uh, uh, Eve's the one that'll treat uh, treat you right, just like a lady. But Lilith will fuck the shit out of you like a whore. Oh. And uh, trust me, that fucking liner hurts, dude. <laughs> Uh, but no, yeah. Give her a give her a follow. Fantastic, uh, fantastic artist. She's gorgeous too. If you just if you just want a, a, a tattoo artist that's pretty to look at, there <laughs> you go. <laughs> Helps you, get, it helps you get through it bro. she's very she, good at conversations uh so she can she, she can hold her own in a conversation so that's but, awesome so if, if if you need someone with good bedside manners there you go <laughs> shout out to her shout out to you for the beers <coughs> shout out to all y'all that follow us on social medias let's shout out to astro boy let's pick him up because he's feeling yeah, down he's, he's been damn dude he's he's the one who t- he's the one who hit the porter hard dude fucking drunk be the shadow on pobrecito pobrecito pinche astro boy so uh if you guys had one thing to say to the people man what would you guys say live your life mm. it's metaphorical <laughs> fuck it why not fuck it why not that's good that's good let's just take chances that's good yeah. seize the day Let's I'll say that. Guys. I'll tell y'all to just take advantage of every day. And if shit and if shit ends up bad at the end, at least you know, drink a porter. End, yeah, drink a porter for the end of it, and then <laughs> drink some more, and then drink some <laughs> more. <laughs> All right, we need to fucking, we need to end on that shit because uh, right, now I, I I can't be in the room with him anymore. <laughs> ya no mas, ya no mas. All right, yeah. well, all right. We'll see you guys next shit week. Uh, be sure to you know like, share, and subscribe on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, fucking whatever whatever we're on. Um, tell all your alcoholic friends about us and if anything we'll see you guys next time we Peace. have been la pura neta la pura neta, la pura neta.